ladies and gentlemen, it's almost that time. Well, it is that time of the year. I got the jersey. You see the poster in the background. Yes, football season is almost here. Thursday night is where we're getting our first preseason game, I think. Yes, preseason is going to be the Browns, of course, versus the Jets. Starters are not playing, but what can you expect? It's still football. It's still football. So, for today's video, I'm going to be doing a tier list on the 2023-24 quarterbacks, okay? I'm not going to do them all because I don't know all of them. I'm going to do most of them, okay? But if you guys like it, hope you guys do like it, okay? So, hey, let's get right on into it. Oh, okay. Now, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. The tier list for the quarterbacks, okay? All right. Now, all the way up to him right here. I don't, some, there's a few quarterbacks these, on these first two rows. There's a few quarterbacks I don't remember their names, but I have seen them play, and they are pretty good, okay? But on this third, but on this third to final row, I don't know who these quarterbacks are because I'm not doing those, okay? I don't know who these quarterbacks are. So, so just to be fair, I'm not ranking them. But this first two row, these this first two rows right here, I'm ranking them, okay? Okay. <sighs> Start off good. Okay. What's his freaking name? He he plays on the Cardinals. He plays on the Cardinals. What's his freaking name? Murray? Something Murray? It's something Murray, I think. He's a good quarterback. He is. But I don't think he's A tier. I think he's B. He's a solid B tier. Okay. The 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 Cardinals are are kind of solid. I put it to you that way. But we're not ranking teams, we're ranking the quarterbacks, and ranking FC. They're gonna have a good season this year. I think he's gonna have a good season. I think he's still going to be a B-tier quarterback. He may get better. We're we just going to have to see. I think he will get better. But the way how this season goes, I'm predicting he's going to stay at B. Okay? All right. This guy who plays for the Seahawks. He brought the Seahawks to the playoffs last year. That's how I noticed him. He's pretty good. But I haven't seen him play. I haven't seen him play a lot though. But he brought the Seahawks to champion to to the playoffs though. That which is a plus. Which kind of makes him B tier. But I gotta see more. I gotta see a little more. I haven't seen. I haven't seen enough of him. I haven't seen enough. I, I gotta see more. I gotta see more. Okay. Justin Fields. Is that his name? Justin Fields, I think. Whew. Justin Fields. I'm going to have to put Justin Fields. The man can run and he can throw. The man from the Ohio State. I know he's from, he's from Ohio State University. I will put Justin Fields. He's a B. He's a good B tier. Like him, him right here, he's not better than these two. That's why I put him at C. Because he, him right here, him right here, he's not better than these two. Okay, so that's why I put him at C. But Justin Fields and Murray at, at B. Okay? Okay. Now, Baker Mayfield. Baker Mayfield. Let me tell you something. If you put Baker Mayfield on a good squad with a good coach, where he's comfortable, where he can thrive, the man can ball out. When he's healthy, he can ball out. Baker Mayfield proved when he's healthy, the man can ball out. Okay? Carolina, they wanted him, but then they did him wrong. So they sent him to Rams. And you saw what he did with the Rams last year? 
all the Baker haters, they just say, hey, I can't hate on them this time. That was, that was cold. Memorize the playbook in two in two days. Look. <laughs> Look. He's not A, though. He's not A. I, I got to see more. You know what? In the way how this season goes, he, he's replacing Tom Brady, who just retired. He's on the Buccaneers now. So I'm going to be looking out for the Buccaneers. I'm going to be looking out for Baker. So I'm going to put him at B. He's a B quarterback. I'm going to put him at B. Okay. He can, and I know he will get better. But I'm putting him at a B. Okay. Derek Carr. Is that his name? Mr. Carr. He's kind of... A, he's kind of A and B ish. Nah, he's an A. He's an A quarterback. He is. He got. He kind of got a soft side to him, but you know, he just wants to win. He's not. Is he still with the Raiders? I think he. I think he left the Raiders though. I think he left. But he can throw. He can read the defense good. He's at a solid. I think he's a solid A. He he's a solid A. I think if you put him on a good squad with a good coach, he could take the team to the playoffs. Even if it's an average team, he could take them to the playoffs. I think I think he's a good quarterback. Patrick Mahomes. S. What can I say? He's 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 that good. Patrick Mahomes is just that good. Um, I have to see it to believe it. And yeah, dude, dude is literally that good. I can't even explain how good Patrick Mahomes is. He's an S tier man. He's he's an S. So yeah, yeah, he's yeah. He says, I can't even explain. Kirk Cousins. Is that Kirk Cousins? I think that's Kirk Cousins. I think that's him. The place for the Vikings. Were the Vikings in the playoffs last year? Hold up. Hold up. Was the Vikings in the playoffs last year? Nope. Okay. It was in 2022. Okay. They were in the playoffs in 2022. Okay. They were in the playoffs last year. But he is a good quarterback. He is. But he's not on these guys. Well, he's kind of... I think I think Baker is better than him. I think Baker is better than him. I I I don't know. I don't I haven't seen too much hype about him. He everybody say he's an average quarterback. He's like a hit or miss. I don't know. I haven't heard I haven't heard too much bad things from the guy. But I wouldn't say he's better than Baker. But I'm gonna still put him at a B. He, he's a B quarterback. I'm going to put him at a B. That's me being nice. That's me being nice. He's a B quarterback. He's B. Okay. Jalen Hurts. A. Jalen Hurts is a solid A. He's a solid A. He can throw. He can read the defense good. He got a solid squad around him. I feel like the Eagles is not going to make the playoffs again. Some people say Jalen Hurst is not that good. They said the squad, they said that that squad, the right, the, the, the talent around them is what's making is what's making them good. I don't know, but for what he's proved last season, he's definitely an A tier. Okay, 
But I got to see him do it again. I got to see him do it again. Okay, so for now, I'm putting him at an A. Lamar Jackson. A. Lamar Jackson is an A. He's a solid A. He can run. He can't throw us good. Well, those two, those two is kind of neck and neck. Well, no, not really. Lamar Jackson can run. He's kind of like this generation's Michael Vick. But Michael Vick can throw better than him, but... Hmm. He got OBJ with him this year, which I'm not worried about. Uh, yeah, I would, yeah. His legs is what's gonna save his life. Does he? Does his squad has a good offensive line? Well, will he have a good season this year? I don't think the Ravens are gonna do that good. That good this year. I I have a feeling they're not gonna do that good. I don't think they're going to do that good. But we're just going to have to see. But Lamar Jackson, he can run. That's all I can say. He can run and he can throw he can throw the football when it matters. He can throw the football when it matters. Okay? So that's why he's a solid A. And he got that big contract. So he's a he sees a solid A. <sighs> Dak Prescott. Dak Prescott. <sighs> He's an A. He's an A quarterback. He is. Yeah, he's a he's an A quarterback. He is. He's an A quarterback. Well, there's been a lot of smack talk about Dak, Dak Prescott. There's been a lot of smack talk about him. But to be honest with you, I think the man is that good. You know, sometimes he has one problem. That's consistency. That's the one thing you got to fix. He's inconsistent. Which is the same as Baker Mayfield. He's inconsistent. But... Baker Mayfield, if you went to st- went through his career, you you understand, which is fixable. But Dak Prescott, he definitely got to fix that. He's inconsistent. He had a good playoff run last year. I do remember that. This season, I felt like he can take the Cowboys to the playoffs again. But we just gonna have to see. But for right now, he's an A. this dude I've seen him before who does he play for again I forgot his name I don't think I'm gonna do him I'm not gonna do him because I I don't I forgot who the I, his face is familiar but I I gotta rec, I gotta know his name I wish they show his names their names on here but yeah I, I'm not doing him. Okay. Russell Wilson. This hurts me. This is going to hurt me. Russell Wilson was good, bro. He was a good quarterback. I'm sorry. My bad. He's a C. He's not, he's not D, though. He's not D. He's a C. Okay. After what went down last season, it's a C. And what they did off season, I haven't heard not much how they what they did off season. They probably made a few moves, but not that major. I don't know, man. I don't think he's gonna do good this year. I, I just have a feeling. I just have a feeling I wish nothing but the best for him I do I, he's a C he's a C okay Lawrence what's his name Trevor Lawrence 
Trevor Lawrence. That's his name, right? Okay. I'm I'm surprised that I'm remember I'm remembering these quarterbacks' names. Trevor Lawrence. He is I'll put him above Baker. He's above Baker. I'll put him over Baker. He's a B. He's a B. You can tell I, that first year he he was with the Jags, not so good. But it wasn't his fault. It was the squad that he was with. But the squad that he's with now, which is still the Jags, they made some upgrades. They had some progress. This year, okay, let's get it going. You can tell, Lawrence, you can tell if he has a good enough squad around him, he can take it to the big time. He can take it to the big time. So I'm putting him putting him at B he's a good B okay Andy Dalton he's a D look man he lost his touch and he kind of lost his touch you know ain't, ain't nobody's worried about him he he was a he he was a dog when he was with Cincinnati but when he left his career kind of went downhill so I I I wish none but the best for him. Hopefully he'll turn it around. But right now he's a he's a D. So Josh Allen. A. Wait. No. S. I put Josh Allen at S. No, wait. This is tough. This is tough. Is a he? He's a he's a. I mean S. My bad. He's a S. He's pretty. He, he's a good quarterback. He's elite. He can throw. He can read the defense. He can run. He's fast. Like, he's going to take the league by storm, man. He is. So, he's a good S. He's a S. He's a S. Joe Burrow. S. Joe Burrow is a S. I'll put Joe Burrow over Josh Allen, but not over Patrick, though. I'll put Joe Burrow over Josh Allen. Let me tell you something about Joe Burrow. That's a bad boy. That is a bad boy. Joe Burrow is a bad boy. That's a bad boy. He's kind of like... He's kind of like Drew Brees and Peyton Manning in one. That's kind of how he is. So, yeah. He's a solid S. I think he's going to be the face of the league. I think Joe Burrow is going to be the face of the league. I, I I truly believe he's gonna be the face of the league. I truly think so. He just had a calf injury. I saw that. He's only gonna be out for a few weeks though, so which is good. Wish him nothing but the best. Speedy recovery. Okay. Okay. Aaron Rodgers. Aaron, you was a good B dog. B quarterback. He's with the Jets now. He's with the Jets. Hold up, I gotta sneeze. <sighs> Bless me. He's with the Jets now, but I let me tell you something. I have a feeling the Jets are not going to do that good this year. I know we're talking about Aaron freaking Rodgers, but 
I just have a feeling he's not going to do good with the Jets this year. I just have a feeling. I just have a feeling he's not going to do that good. But he's still a good quarterback, though. He's definitely a legend. And him taking a pay cut for his team around him to get better shows how much of a trooper he is. But, man, I just have a feeling, man. I just have a feeling. I wish none but the best for him. Okay. Stafford. He's a C. I, the reason, hear me out. The reason why I put Matthew Stafford at a C is because, one, I know he just had an injury. He, he, he was out that whole last season. But the Rams went super downhill. They won the Super Bowl in 2022. But then the next following year, they just went in a downward spiral. Everybody got hurt. Then Baker went on the team. It was a lot of hype, which everybody thought Baker was going to stay with the Rams, but he decided to go to Tampa, which I wish him much success there. But Stafford, I got to see. When he was with the Lions, I didn't think he, he was good. But he wasn't great. I don't think he's a B though. I think he's a C quarterback. I think he that year when he went to the Super Bowl, I think he was just in that that right situation. I think he was just in the right moment. So, not saying it was just pure luck. I just think he was just in the right moment, in the right situation at the right time. I just think that's that's how he got that ring. So, he he's a C. He's a C. Matt Ryan D Matt Ryan I'm sorry dude you was a D you did not you, you was a good you was good with the Falcons well you had a good run with the Falcons but then you went to the Colts didn't make that much noise pretty much going downhill you're kind of I'll put you above Andy Dalton no well I don't they're kind of neck and neck nah they're kind of neck and neck I'm gonna leave it at that but he could turn it around this season but hey we'll, we'll just gonna have to see Deshaun Watson he is a he is a B I put him below Aaron Rodgers. He's a B. I know he's been gone. He missed a whole year. Came back half a year last year. The previous year. Rusty as hell. But I've seen his practice tapes this offseason. And the man looks good. Looks like he's getting back into the swing of things. So right now, I'm going to say he's a B. He's a B. And the Browns, if you take a look at their squad, I know I'm a Browns fan, but if you take a look at their squad right now, ooh, that's a, if I say it, when it comes to football, if you say something positive, sometimes it gets turned into a negative. But I'm just going to keep my... I want to say it so bad. But the Cleveland Browns... take just take a look at their squad and watch what they do this season just watch just watch 
if ever, just, just, just watch, just watch. <sighs> okay. He he used to play for the Eagles. Then he got a ring with the Eagles. I think he got a ring with the Eagles. But he is a D. He's actually below D. But uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know too much about. Uh, I know he he had a good good year with the Eagles, and then it just went on a downward spiral for the rest of his career. So he's a D. That's all I gotta say. Okay, the man from the Ohio. No, who's from Ohio State? No, he's from Ohio State. No, is it him or him? Either him or him is from Ohio State. I I saw the draft this this past year. Th- this year, I I saw. I saw the draft. This, this he, well, whatever. They say he's a bad boy. Okay. Sorry, some keeps popping up on my computer, but I'm gonna put him. They say he's a bad boy. He was a bad boy in college. So, he was the first number one. He was the number one overall draft pick. So I will. I'm up. I'm gonna put him at a low B. He's at a low B. Okay. I I don't watch college football, but judging from the draft and the squad that he's on, the Carolina Panthers. Uh, I think he's gonna have a. I think he's gonna have a B tier season. A B tier C. Him. Uh, to be honest with you, I don't know too much about him, so I'm not gonna do him. He was with the Jets, but no, no, he wasn't. Wait, wait, that looks like a Jets uniform, right? I don't know too much about him, so I'm not gonna do him. Okay. This guy. Was it? Was it he from Ohio State? I don't know. They say he's a bad boy too in college. He was a bad boy. So I'm going to put him at the same rank. A B. He wasn't number one overall. Could have been. But wasn't. I think he was second. Overall. Or third. I think he was second. But he's a bad boy too. Well, I'm going to put him at B. See how good he'll be. I think he's going to have a B. I think, I think he's going to have a better season than him. I'm not going to lie to you. I think he's going to have a better season than him. I think so. But we're going to have to see. Right now, both of these rookie quarterbacks are at a B. Okay. Justin Herbert. I'll put him above Lamar. He, Justin Herbert. Is that his name? Herbert? He's an A. He's a solid A. The reason why I put him at an A. His vision on the field is really good. He has good vision. His vision on the field is really good. He can read defenses. He can lightweight run. He's lightweight a problem. So I I put him at a good. I put him I put him right next to Jalen Hurts. Matter of fact, I'll put my bad. I'll put Jalen Hurts right here. Wait. There we go. Let me rearrange this. Rearrange this. Okay. Bam. That's how that that's it. That's it right there. That's it. Okay. Jimmy Garoppolo. I uh, I don't uh, to be honest with you I haven't I haven't heard much or seen much from him this past season. Did he get hurt? I don't I don't I don't remember, but I haven't seen much or heard from him much. I I, I can't put him at a I don't want to if I put him at a C. If I put him at a, a C, it's gonna be lightweight, kind of disrespectful. 
He's at a low B. Uh, you know what? Uh, he's at a low B. A low B. No, he's... He's like a C plus. He's a C plus. I haven't heard much from him. I haven't seen much from him. I shouldn't rate him at all, but he's like a low B. He's like a low B to a C. So he's like he's really in between, you know. I heard that he, this quarter. I heard Jimmy Garoppolo is a good quarterback, but. We're just going to have to see this season. Okay, I don't know what team he's going to play for this season, but we're just going to have to see. This guy, he plays for the Dolphins, right? They say he's really good. I haven't seen much of him, but they say he's really good. He made a lot of noise with the Dolphins last season. So, I'm going to put him at a, I'll put him, I'll put him right here. He's a good B. He's a B. I haven't seen much, but I, I know he the much noise that he made, he's a good B. This guy, I don't remember his name, but he plays for the Patriots. His first year, killed it. His first year, he killed it. But after that, I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened. So, for right now, he's going to be the youngest quarterback that's at a C. I don't know, man. I got to see you do. I got to see you make some improvements. You know, I got to see you make some improvements, man. That's that's all I got to say. Got to see you make some improvements. These quarterbacks, let me go through this last list one more time. Uh, he kind of, kind of no. Okay, he plays for the Giants, but I'm not going to do him. Okay, all these other quarterbacks, I don't I don't know or I haven't seen before, so I'm not going to do them. But this is my list. Take a look at it, screenshot it, and yeah, there you have it. Mm-hmm. Rudy, how'd you like that tier list? You enjoyed it? You like it? That's what I'm talking about, Rudy. All right. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is my tier list for the 2023-24 quarterbacks. I, I, sorry I didn't do them all. I don't know all the quarterbacks, but I did what I knew most of the most part. But, hey. It is what it is, man. Hope you guys enjoy it. Football season is right on the way. It's right on our hips. So, hey, can't wait for can't wait for this season. What it has in store for us. And ladies and gentlemen, please post comments down below. Let me know what you all think about this tier list. Please like, subscribe, and share. And my book, The Prodigy, is out now. Link in the description down below. And a Prodigy, two and three will be out soon on Amazon Kindle in September 18th. That's the official date for my second and third book. It's going to be out September 18th. I'll see you guys next time. God bless.